As a developer, you'll want to grab the code and different assets from your designer's mockups. For iOS and macOS projects, measurements are in points. For Android projects, measurements are in DP. And for web projects, measurements are in pixels. So if you notice as I move around the mouse here and click, you'll see that it gives me different pixel dimensions based on the width and height of different items. Now you'll also notice when I click on something, it gives me the CSS, which I can quickly copy to the clipboard. Now in a previous video, we covered how to export our icons from our sketch file here, so they're able to be downloaded. Now if I go up to this top navigation here, you'll see that we're on the information section. Now if I hit colors, it'll also show different colors that we used in our mockup. And then I can choose assets, the third icon here. So as a developer, I can easily download all of the available assets depending on the project type. So for web, you'll get PNGs and SVGs. For iOS, you'll get PNG and PDFs. For Android, you'll get five different resolutions of PNGs and an SVG. To download, all you have to do is click the little download icon here, and then choose where you want to save it to. You can also choose the naming convention to camel case, snake case, kebab case, or original, which will default to however they were named in your sketch or Photoshop file. Lastly, you'll see that we can click on the notes section here and it will list out all of the different notes that we have. And if you click on them, it'll take you directly to the note. So as a developer, this is a great way to quickly see all of the notes that either your designer left or some of your other teammates left.